Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up basic connection related event handlers for your Mindflare bot in Python. So we made a few changes from our last bot. So this was last tutorial and this is this tutorial. This one's going to be a bit more advanced here. Um, first thing that we're going to do is we're going to separate the bot arguments from the bot creation itself. This is going to help us down the line where we're going to have more and more separation between our bot arguments and the bot creation itself. So might as well split them up now. So here we're setting up our bot arguments and then on a different line, we are creating the bot. Moving on, we're gonna get into our first event listener that we are actually using. So last time we had this event listener, our login event, we were doing nothing. This time we will actually be making use of it. And we can do that very simply by taking a look at the bot.client.socket. This is where we're gonna find all the socket or connection socket related information for the bot. And then we are then going to print out if it is connected to a server, which server is connected to. And if it is not connected to a server, then which host it is connected to. The next event we're going to be taking a look at here is the kick event. So this will flag anytime you are either already connected to a server and get kicked from the server, or if you are kicked while trying to connect to a server within that process there. And uh, this comes with two permit parameters. So we've got the reason for why you got kicked and whether or not you were logged in previously. So first we're going to check whether or not you were logged in. If you were, well, it means you got kicked from a server that you're already logged into and it's going to say why. And if you weren't already connected to a server, it means you got kicked while trying to connect and then it'll say why you got kicked. And last but not least here, we've got the end event. So this will trigger anytime your bot disconnects fully. So this is when you're bot is essentially no longer connected to the server whatsoever. So this generally flags immediately after the um, kick from the server if you aren't planning to reconnect or anything like this. And this is essentially our uh, finish or the end of our script, right? So in this case, our bot isn't trying to reconnect. It's just going to log in, get kicked, and then it's done. And with that, there are a few things we want to do at the end of our script. With all of these event listeners that we are opening up, we need to actually close them at some point and we want to do that at the end of running our script. So you can see here um, at the end, so whenever this triggers, it'll give a reason for why we disconnected. We're gonna write that we disconnected and why this, if you got kicked, will be that you got kicked. And then with that, we wanna turn off all your event listeners. This is very simple and you're gonna to wanna to do this every single time you add a new event listener. You're gonna to wanna to come down here and make sure that you include it in your off statements. You can do this very simply. So here you can see we have our login event uh, where we have the string login and we have the function login. We're going to go here. We're going to do off bot the string login and then the function login. And the same thing for kick. So we've got the string kicked. Then we've got the function kicked. We're going to go off bot string kicked function kicked. And then we just keep going like that for all of them. In this case, we have uh, login kicked and end. And so then here we have login kicked and end. Now that we've gone over all of our new additions, we're gonna open up a Minecraft client, just like last time, once again in version 1.19.4, and we'll be taking a look at that. All right, guys, now that I've got a vanilla 1.19.4 client open in a single player world, once again, I'm gonna press escape, open to LAN, go to creative mode, allow cheats on, type in the same port number, which is 3000 for our script, click start LAN world. Gonna go back to VS Code, I'm going to click control tilde, which is a hotkey for opening up your console. Then we're going to do Python 02 dash connect bots. This is the name of our file that our bots in. Press enter there. And then if we go back to our world, we should be able to see the bot will log in. There we go. And we can go up to the bot. And now I'm going to do slash kick and then connect bot. And the reason is going to be hello. We're going to press enter. And then you're going to see that in our console it says you got kicked from the server with the text hello so this is the reason why and then it says uh we disconnected because the socket closed so this socket closed because we got kicked and then our script ends correctly that's gonna be it for this tutorial if you have any questions please leave them down in the comments down below or you can join my discord and ask them there if you want more generalized help with mindflare as a whole feel free to join the mindflare discord that will also be linked down in the description i also leave a list of reference links these are references that i use for making this tutorial making the script so if you want to read more about these events and how they work feel free to take a look at those as always at the top of the description you'll find a link to where you can find the code that i use in the tutorial that you can copy paste from if you want to do so that's it for today Please leave a like if you enjoy the video. Cheers.